Yeah. Yeah. Here's your look good. Dr. Lomax, good, uh, good, good afternoon. How are you? Good. Congratulations to you. Do, this yeah. is a very important occasion Burke. here on 7th Street. What's the significance of the United Negro College Fund, and why should people care about this building that's being built today? Well, this is uh, an important relocation for UNCF. We've been out in the suburbs for the last 17 years, mm -hmm. and this is an opportunity for us to come into the district, uh, not only to be a part of the education reform that's underway here, but also to be accessible to young people. You know, we, we award over 10,000 scholarships annually to students attending nearly a thousand colleges and universities and so this will make it much easier for students here in the district and the many thousands of students who come to the district uh, throughout the year as tourists mm -hmm. to learn more about what it takes to apply to college, what kind of courses they need to take to prepare for college and what opportunities there are for financial support in order to help them relieve the cost of going to college. So it's important that we be accessible to students and this is a great location right up over a metro station right in the heart of the district, very close to Howard University where many students come to, to visit and tour and learn about that great institution. And they'll be able to learn about other institutions that they can attend as well. Okay, see the shovel that you have. This is a very unique looking uh, handle. It's just kind of a, kind of a square yeah, well, wooden handle. Yeah, it's a is nice... Is it walnut uh, or what is it? <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it's a, it's a uh, special... A special shovel, mm -hmm. one that I'm going to hold on to. Yeah, remind I bet you're not going to let this go. <laughs> remind me of this wonderful event. Of course, I'm also looking for a, a, a pair of scissors for the ribbon cutting. That's going to be the best day when we're actually in the What building. exact month will that be? Well, If things are on schedule. Know, yeah, uh, it would be in the fall of, uh, of uh, 2012. It's about 18 months away. So okay. we're looking forward to being there as well. You planning on being there? I hope so. Unless there you go. Really, uh, there you I'm, go. I'm, I'm still under contract. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us about the building and what, uh, did you have any input in the design of no, the building? No, not in the design. We, we're we buying uh, half of a building that is already designed. It will get half of the building, uh, 50,000 square feet. We'll be able to relocate, relocate our headquarters, bring about 110 of our employees here. And very importantly, we'll be able to provide our direct scholarship services here. Mm -hmm. And so that's an important uh, incentive for students who are in school here. They'll learn more about how, how to apply to college, how to apply for financial aid, and we'll help them, hopefully, more district students going on to college. Now, are there as many programs available as there have been in the past? We know that there's been uh, yeah, so UN, many UN, UNCF continues to grow its, uh, its scholarship portfolio. We have over 400 scholarships. 10,000 scholarships we're awarding this year, and we anticipate seeing that number continue to grow. Mm -hmm. So the recession is sort of... Well, the recession is tough, but we're we're aggressive, and we're looking for more financial support for students. Okay, so let's get the word out. What's the uh, website that people need to know? UNC, uh, www.uncf.org. Uh, go there and learn more about uh, UNCF and the scholarships that are available. Good that we had some such good weather today, so you're looking great. Thank, Thank you so much.